I really like chips. Look at it! Ooh. Good morning everyone and welcome to vlog three of the Quarantine Diaries. I have only just got up and it's like 11 o'clock. Whoops. So I have been up since seven, but I've been editing a video and then I've been working on the side as well. So it's been a busy morning, but I feel kind of lazy at the same time. So I've got up now, got a little bit of mascara and brow gel on, and I'm wearing my cute little pink dress again and pink cardigan to give myself a little bit of a boost of colour. Hair up like this, need to wash it, need to bake tan, need to make a cake because I said that in my last video and I realised I didn't do it. So whoops. So in this video we're going to be doing a fair few things again. So today is Wednesday, I've probably already put it down here what the date is. Me and Adam did a shop at Tesco's yesterday and oh my god they have reduced so many Easter eggs, it is insane. So my boot is full of Easter eggs because I was giving out to family that I can't see so I just put them on the doorstep. So yeah I did that, that was quite cute and cheered my friend up Sophie yesterday because her poor cat was broken a leg. So I went and dropped an Easter egg off at a door and then I'll drop one off at my sister's today so that you know makes people smile because we need people to keep smiling at this point. Plan for today need to get more shit done yeah nice and sunny i'm gonna start waffling because i notice it's quite boring when i waffle i do know that but yeah i'm gonna have some breakfast so yeah. on the vlog today mainly been working and i didn't really do much i'd rather not vlog when i'm not really doing much because i don't want it to be boring for you guys to watch so we have just come back from tesco's and morrison's to drop some easter egg off at my sister's because she didn't get an egg bless us and she's stuck obviously so we bought lots of easter eggs but I like giving them to family and friends just to cheer them up, put them on their doorstep at the moment so it's a little nice thing doing that's so cheap like the eggs are like 50p, £1.150 £1. so and then I bought my brother one as well as an additional little present for his birthday which is next week and obviously you can't really celebrate because you can't go anywhere and he's working hard for the NHS on and bro at the moment I'm waiting for dinner to cook what is my timer on it's got five minutes left to go so I'm gonna set up my laptop and start editing a blog post to that i'm gonna update you on my book i don't get very far do i i'm so close to finishing it and i've probably got like i'm on chapter 75 so i ain't got long to go there's like i think there's like 85 or something chapters in there but i haven't got long at all to go and i need to keep read my blogosphere magazine as well so i'm literally so behind i'm literally like a year behind on magazine to read so i've cancelled the subscription because i just i can't keep up you know i love it but i just can't keep up there's no point in me having something i can't keep up with because i'd rather read a book but i love black blogosphere magazine they do such good things but i'm so excited to get the new one which the Nikki Lily one. It's got Anastasia Kings off in there because I literally love her. I watch her videos all the time. This is how far behind I am. I'm on the Alfie Day issue which I don't even know when it was published so no I'm very far behind. I've just noticed I use this Yolt app. It is very good. Also at this time if you're trying to budget good thing to try out. Especially if you're bored. So I'm going to stop nattering because yeah. Dinner is served. Got these new vegan burgers. Come on in. I'm going to do some yoga and possibly a mini workout. Oh, and then we'll get cracking for the day. <laughs> We are so random You bring the darkness to the light Split the atom I ignore the fact That this will never last Your words come out so soothing That I forget that this thing is confused Okay, I wasn't expecting to do fast yoga I just did one of the Pyordium 7 minute yoga sessions I'm not relaxed I feel exhausted It's called the recharging yoga flow You see it there That was just I don't feel like that was like very calming I feel like it was just very fast paced I don't know yoga can be fast paced But I prefer it when it's quite slow and relaxed I'm probably going to do a another 7 minute workout And then get to it Having such a blast But don't ask where my head is at Cause I'm cruising through the rest of us I don't care about love, just need your touch I'm done. I did a seven minute hit. No, it won't hit. What was it? Seven minute body burn. I'm happy with that. I think I need more space though. It's hard to do it. I don't sweat, but I'm sweating on my back right now. It's a good one. Hi, so I've got a confession to make. I've just eaten a third of a tube of Pringles. Oh dear. 
just sat at the table with my two laptops. Currently just waiting to do some things and I'm doing a order on Superdog. Don't know if I'm going to order anything, but I was reading something from Hayley Beauty. They sent me an email about in care and how thermal water is good to use. So it stops you having... Yeah, it says that thermal water is good for... You have to spray it on your face to avoid lime residue. So I didn't... I never knew that. So I might get some to try out. There's a La Pouche... I don't know how to say it. La Pouche... I don't know. La, La Rouge Pouche. That's what it is. And that's like five pounds something. So I might get that. I like my little beauty products. I'm gonna make, probably make an order on there because I've got a bit of a sale, so I'll give it a go. Sorry, it's like so in and out. Then to serve, I did have more chips than this, but I was eating them all as I was waiting for my toastie. I've got a vegan toastie there with vegan chicken, well, corn slices with vegan cheese, lettuce, and some chips and a shitload of salt. Oh, and don't forget the barbecue. How much chocolate we got the other day? All reduced. These were 25p. These are all 50p. How much were the Reese's? 12p? 12p, yeah. Yeah? And then how much were the Milky Bars? Uh, about the same, I think. 12p. And then this was like 98p for a 12 pack. What are they? 50p or something? On the 38p? Anyway, yeah, really cheap. We've got loads more eggs in the car as well. <laughs> Proper eggs. Mental, how many there is here. You know how earlier I said that I was shopping on Superdrug? I've left Superdrug for now and I'm on more food because I've got 50% off sale. And look what I'm buying. As we know, I love the Jacqueline Hill palette, so I'm getting one that's got like orange shades in there, and then I'm getting an eye brush collection and a felt tip liquid lightener because I really need a new one. That's one twenty-seven pound bargain. One half pound. It's Friday. Currently doing some work and watching Amy on YouTube on the side. I've got like, the two laptops set up, and then just watching YouTube on the side. Just realised what I was supposed to get. Oh yeah, my kind of Dr Pepper. Getting that off the floor. And I read a bit of my book in the garden yesterday. Quite enjoyed that. Really need to finish it though because getting on myself for how long I'm taking. Then I need to read my Blogsphere magazine. Also had a bit of a munch last night. Whoops. Alongside my online order. What are we doing today? Oh yeah, I'll have a face mask pump and all tonight. If I remember to do it. Also, I forgot to tell you that we bought some new face wash and scrubs from... Uh, uh, whoops. From Aldi. Remember that vegan range that they had in? Got the face wash for one ninety nine, pretty sure. And then I got this oh Lacura Pink Clay Exfoliating Face Wash. So I'm very excited to try this. Not face wash, face scrub, sorry. And it's so cute in pink. This reminds me of the Lizelle cleanser, but I'm hoping it's gonna be like the same sort of texture, but you can see that. Looks really strange. Anyway. I'll give that a go. And the face wash, maybe tonight. I'm trying to use up the products that I've got with me before I use anything new. So I've literally got a box of stuff. Let me just... So this is my box of toiletries that I keep at Adam's. So I've got so much. I've got like my serum down there. I've got a little bit of Elizabeth Arden. More there. The Body Shop. Eco Cooking. Body Butter. Hair Oil. Living Proof Dry Shampoo. Hydra Thing. I can't remember what it's called. I've got loads of products that like I haven't used in ages that I bring here and make sure that I use them. Use this like pretty much every day. And this for my hair. And this is actually running out. I'm quite sad about this. That's why I've got the green one to top me up. Yeah, and I've got like loads of different sprays and stuff in there that I really need to use up. And then that's my daily bag of things. Let me open it and show you. I've got random bits in here. Oh, this is amazing. One of the best creams I've ever bought, but it's so expensive, like £16 for this one little thing. We've got some Estee Lauder eye cream. What else have we got in here? You know I love a bit of friction-free shaving. Love their razors. I've got a little bit of serum in here as well. I literally, I love my skincare, and this is also a hand cream that I'm using at the minute as well from Lost of Time. Just love using my skincare, but I've got so much, so I use all this up before I get some more in. So I've got loads. Okay, I'm going to have my Sundose vitamins now. I've actually shown you these before, but I had them for a while and I haven't even tried them yet. I'm going to try with you today and it comes with like this little squidgy thing you have to keep it in the fridge and then the powder which i've mixed up in here is so orange so i'm gonna try it with you and let you know how it is i'm not very good with taking these so i'll attempt it but i'm gonna swallow it and not chew it because, yeah it says swallow and wash it down so i don't think i'm gonna squidge it open let's try it, it smells like pure orange juice it tastes like orange juice as well oh let's have this thing now so strong oh, i don't think i mix it properly right try this I'm terrible at taking tablets. <laughs> I'm gonna try this for 30 days. I'm gonna try and have it every day. I'm literally rubbish to do this, but I've got an app on my phone that I use on the daily that I try and use daily. It's called Fabuloso, 
actually I'll put a little thing on the screen in the corner of what I'm doing on my phone. So I'm going to go into the app called Fabi Loose. Like this and don't add or anything. This is just something that I found scrolling through Insta stories one day. And I've got my morning routine, have a eating challenge, afternoon routine, short walk and evening routine. So in the morning I have drink water, take vitamins and do yoga. I haven't done my yoga today. So at 9 o'clock I have breakfast, drink water and eat for your health. For my afternoon routine I have call your parents, <coughs> drink water, reconnect with friends. So basically like texting and communicating because at this time just keep in contact with people. So then I have a short walk, for, not really a short walk, it ends up being like an hour long. And then a bit of exercise and drink more water because I'm not very good at drinking water. Hence why I have my big bottle. So then in the evening I do dinner, so let's get cooking, and I read and have a cup of tea. But I don't actually have a cup of tea, I have hot chocolate because I'm not really into tea with almond milk. I prefer it with soy milk, which we don't have. So yeah, that is my little app that I love using. And I'm going to have these on the daily and then probably do a blog post or something on them. See how I get on. Got my gal Amy on and some nice flowers whilst I'm working. Just wanted to update you on this. The carrot juice. I don't know, carrot juice is a thing. So I feel a bit weird. I don't know why, but I do take B12 tablets as well. And I've just read on the website it has B12 in it, so I'm hoping that I'm not having too much B12 or something. But there's a fair few. Is that a blender? What? Yeah, a blender. So there's vitamin C, B, E, B12, B, and it's B, A as well. Let me just check. So this is what's in it. So there's bioactive substances, minerals, omega-3 acids, and probiotics, and the vitamins. So the vitamins that are in there are all of these. Vitamin E, D, C, B12, B9, B7, B6, B5, B3, B2. So that's quite good. Oh yeah, that's very healthy for it. Also, I don't know whether you guys like reading blogs and stuff, but <coughs> on my blog today, I have my how to stay healthy whilst at home blog post up. And I also have a few more like 10 things I'm going to do once lockdown is over. And then once, oh. No, that's my Pinterest. Wants to watch on Netflix during lockdown. Best rise in Disneyland. Sorry about my voice. And then how to stay motivated when working from home. Also 20 things to do in, in self-isolation. So only things to read on there. Evening, I've been doing my blog for like three hours now. I figured out how to do a reward style like shopping thing where people can shop what's in my... Oh, that was a bit loud. Dinner's almost done. Hey Siri. No, not you. Hey Siri. Hey Siri, put a timer on for 10 minutes please. Your timer is set for 10 minutes. So I have been like linking outfits and stuff to my blog post that matches what is on there. It took me ages to do it and I'm so glad that I finally figured out how to do it. So that there's like affiliate links and stuff like that if you've not heard of reward style before. I finally figured out how to do it and I'm very happy that I've done it but I'm literally my back is killing. Just sat here as a laptop all day. I've been here since like half past nine and it's now six o'clock. So I've been set the table like nine hours. <laughs> what else am I going to do? Cooking dinner as well. We're having chicken sausages, beans and chips, some just standards today. Dinner is so I'm back in bed. So I'm going to read my book. See if I can actually finish it because you're probably sick of me talking about it and I really need to finish it. And Adam's got a cheat day video on in the background. All that I just saw was Krispy Kreme, glazed donuts, and I'm like fucking donut. Just want a donut. But we are living off Easter eggs right now. It is ridiculous. I've got an OMO one that I need to finish, which I'll eat now. Are you ready? Oh. <laughs> it's breaking it! We are having way too much fun with these Easter eggs. Mm. So I have been playing around with my blog again this morning and I've now got a new ooh, a new logo on here because this one I didn't feel like it was right and I've changed all my links on here so it's all pink and it's all matching, changed the fonts and I just feel like it looks so much fresher with just your like just that, it's just so much more simplistic. So on the side I have sorted out a little thing. I have put my little feed on here and I've also made um, it link up to my like to know it page so I have been very busy linking things yet again. Oh, my, I've actually put my own page in it. Oh God. So this is my like to know it page. So I will link it down below if you would like to shop my outfits. All different little products I'm wearing. And similar ones as well. I thought that might be a bit of interest for you. So you can know that I for you to know that you can now shop my outfits on like to know it. So yes, I have been very busy this morning just doing that admin stuff and like revamping my blog and things like that. And I'm going to edit Sunday's video, which is the loungewear haul. I will link it down below for you because it'll be up by the time this vlog is up. And I'm quite happy that I've quite sort of, like, I've sorted it all out because I've been meaning to do this for ages. But like, it's those little things, like admin things that take ages just to sort out. I'm so happy I've finally done it because it makes more sense now. I know what I'm doing. I'll just do it like that and oh, it just looks so much better. I'm so happy with it. And I thought I was going to get like a new logo and everything, but this just looks so much more pulled together and more simplistic. It just looks so much better and more professional, so I'm very happy with that. Okay, I'm up now. I'm dressed. 
got me uh, addicted to French Forest top on and some joggers because I'm literally living in this outfit. Hair is just not doing its thing today. I've just wrapped up my bro my brother's presents. All in here. No, it's not from Superdrug, but it's wrapped in Christmas Christmas wrapping paper. But you know, desperate times, desperate measures. So yeah, I've done that. Need to put this away. I need to edit that video that I said I was gonna edit the lounge I want, and I still haven't done it because I've been sweating out my blog, and I'm very proud of it. I'm gonna put some lunch on now. I picked up some cauliflower lettuce pasties that were from Aldi and one picked up for me to get them in the freezer. And I'm gonna have them with chips and the rest of my beans from yesterday. I'm so excited to try it, oh my god. I bloody love chips. I really do, I don't know if you noticed in my vlogs, I really like chips. Also, there's been this thing in Adam's room that's been bugging me and it's like this really high-pitched sound. It makes you sound like you've got tinnitus. And I just found out what it was. It was this weird air scented thing and I think it ran out of stuff and it's just squealing every so often. It was, I was stood like by the wall drove oh, I heard it and that lit up and I was like oh, I only find out what it was because I don't know why we thought it was the boiler or the plug socket or something because I accidentally dropped a drink on it the other day oops but I'm annoyed I'm very happy that I found out what it was then it is served <coughs> with that veggie very cauliflower lettuce pasty so let's try this fries, fries. <laughs> But I'm running like I'm lost in the woods, yeah I don't really care Cause I just like it here Me and you can Oh, gotta be careful Adam just chucked the fucking egg at me Look at it <laughs> It's right there He just chucked it through the window <laughs> He's such a muppet He had an egg at his head <laughs> Did you crack it? Uh, yeah, you got another one in your hand. Checking in, I'm editing a beauty blog post, which is new in beauty for spring. And I have also got Amy on in the background, watching her, what, what is it called? What's it on a Michael Kors bag video? So I'm being productive, and I'm also looking on Morphe again, which is a bad idea. But. So Adam's just decided we should order in a pizza. I ain't gonna deny uh, the fact that I want a pizza, because I actually can't be bothered to cook and it's 10 to 8. And a pizza sounds good just about now. So what are we having? Oh, I don't know. Oh, Hawaiian. Do we have to pick it up? No, no, it's contactless delivery. I'll just drop it at the door. Because, you know, hashtag, hashtag, <laughs> hashtag stay home. Pizza is ordered, found on offer. Pizza teller or something like that. And we've got a bar one on free pizza. And we've got a garlic, no, cheesy garlic bread pizza. We've got two pizzas, cheesy garlic bread, fries. I think that was it, wasn't it? Came to about, it came to £19 in the end, which is pretty good because it was bar one and get one free offer. And other places were quite expensive. But we're not going to get it until half nine and it's currently quarter past eight. So it's going to be a late night for us, but I do not mind. Pizza has finally arrived. I've got a Hawaiian pizza. I've got a garlic bread with cheese pizza, fries. And Adam's got a tandoori one, if you can see. Six, oh, wow, look, like I've got no hair. It is about, it's literally almost 12 o'clock. And I'm only just getting dressed to go for a run. Yeah, I'm actually going for a run after like three weeks. I'm not doing it. Whoops. But I've been doing a little bit of workout, but a little bit of a workout every every other day, but not as often as what I should be. But I am just having a brunch bar for breakfast. Well, brunch. It's not breakfast anymore. And I've been editing my blog like from four years ago. Some posts. It's so awkward when you walk in and I'm vlogging. <laughs> I've been editing posts since like seven o'clock this morning. Oh my god, my eyes and my head are hurting from doing it for like four hours. And uh, I'm so glad that I'm doing it because it, it makes it look so much better. Because like, I know some people go quite far back in my blog post and I'll either find them on Google or something. And it's like a really old one. It looks shocking. So I've like edited so many and there's like 460 posts altogether. It's took me like forever. But literally this weekend has been like pure admin on my blog. Not even intentionally. <laughs> Almost dropped to then. Not even intentionally. But anyway, I'm going to go for a run and then finish off doing that when I come back. Because I think I've got about 150 to go. I've just run 5k. Would you believe? Would you believe it? actually run 5k obviously it was a walk slash run but i did it and i'm actually sweating properly it's mad so i think i'm gonna have a shower because i just feel i'm so glad that i've done it adam did the 5k yesterday for the um you know when you nominate five run 5k nominate five and then donate five so he's gonna tag me in that and then i've done it too and then i can donate five pound to the nhs so I'm very happy that I've done that now. I'm all fresh and wet head. I'm just going to do a face mask. Oh, this blooming thing gets so wet. Oskia London Renaissance mask. And it literally leaks everywhere, but it's my own fault because I basically stuck this little thing inside here. So it kind of like popped the top open. So I'm just going to put on a face mask with you. Because I've been meaning to do this for like the last few days and I haven't been doing it. Oh my god, look at the consistency. It's 
freaking everywhere. No, you know, act it, but I know this is a blur flow. Have it such a blast, but don't ask when I. Hey Siri, put a timer on for 15 minutes. Cause I'm cruising through the rest. All glowy faced. Now I'm gonna put some body butter on. I'm gonna put on the last of my banana body butter. I can't believe it's the last bit. Absolutely gutted because this is gonna be discontinued now. Well, it is discontinued. I've literally bought so much of it and this is literally the last part of it. Oh, I'm so gutted. Does anyone else oh, try that range out? Oh, it was such a nice range from the body shop. All the banana stuff, all the. I oh, literally had every single product. And the banana face mask, the banana. Not face mask, I meant to say hair mask. Banana hair mask. The shampoo, conditioner, the body yogurt, and of course, body butter. I'm gonna love myself in this and get all glowing. I've only done one leg and it's all gone, so I'm gonna have to try this out instead. The body cream, body cooking. Just realised I haven't checked some of you since like when I was doing my face mask. I've had pizza for lunch, leftovers from last night. Not long come off the phone with Charlotte, one of my blogger friends. We FaceTimed and fi figured out some things about our blogs and stuff like that. It's a really productive weekend on my blog. Like, done a fair bit. I still haven't finished doing all them blog posts, I've still got just as much as I told you, about 150 to go, which I need to do that when we come back from our walk. If I walk now, and then I show Charlotte how much I've got left in my book. She's like, you need to finish that today. I'm like, but I won't. I'm going to give it a go. There's at least about 30, 40 pages maybe left. Not a lot. So I really should do it. So have a productive evening and then I really want to start reading my blog is Fear Magazine. But then I've got like four more before this. But we'll, we'll just see what happens. We'll see if I'm going to do it. I'm getting sick of seeing my face by now. Just come back from the shop we went to because we were craving Dr Pepper. So we went and got Dr Pepper from the shop and picked up some drumsticks. The, uh, I didn't know that these were vegan. That's quite exciting. Exciting? Exciting. I got one of these little rip rolls. I just fancy. I love the cheap sweets. I had another one as well that was like 30p. I love them. Um, I think it's like licorice or something. It's got like an e icing. Friggin' hiccup with peeing me off right now. Anyway, I'm back on my blog again and I'm going through the rest of my posts that I need to go through. And I've just read. Oh! I just realised my new video went out like two hours ago. I need to share that as well. It is the loungewear haul. I will leave it in the eye for you. Why is this? this? Yeah, there we go. Bit of focus. Look how much my face is glowing. What the hell? That's from that mask that I use. Sorry that I keep hiccuping. That mask is made me glow. What the hell? I also put that glow cream on as well. My bags are actually real light right now. I look so tired. I literally look like I'm balling my eyes out and I'm just literally like this all the time. My bags are always so bad. Any tips on how to get rid of them? Because well, they're not even bags. They're just like dark circles. Is that always been there? Any tips? Leave them down below if you know how to get rid of these. We're currently just watching Harwin Car Diaries. He's just put up a video that is shaving his own head. So he's trying to do a fade, and I'm in absolute stitches at this man. He is so funny. Guess what's happening? I am shaving Adam's head. I've got to try and do a fade. I am so nervous about it. I feel like I'm gonna make it go so a bit. Bad <laughs> it now. Good morning everyone, I'm about to do some yoga. Oh my god, my face is glowing again. I'm literally loving this cream. So this is what I've been using on my face, the Glam Glow Galactic Cleanse. And then I've been putting on this. I obviously normally switch up my serums and stuff, but this is almost empty, so I really want to use that up. And then I've been using this Air Boring Glow Cream. And then under my eyes, the Estee Lauder Eye Balm. And then on my lips, Trusty Carmex, because I love it. And that is how I get my glow at the moment. Lunch time. Just run. <laughs> Run. Another, yeah, whatever, ran. Another 5k, and I'm dying. Oh Red, what a is this? Looks so good to go. Yeah, you're always good to go. You want me out? It is pamper time. I'm finally doing some fake tan. I'm using this one because my other one, I realise it ran out quite a while ago. There's only a little bit in there, but it runs out after six months. And considering how it looks like grim, I don't really want to risk it. Especially if it's going to be like a funny colour. So I'm going to bin that, but I'm going to keep the tanning mix. I love these. They're so nice and velvety. And then I'm finally going to do some nails because literally look at them. Look at the gels. How much they've grown. It's mad. But the other hand looks like this. So I've got one gel left on that. You see how much it's grown? the hell? Oh god. Anyway, so I'm going to put them on from Primark that I've got 50p. Because we're going to be living in these throughout lockdown. And my little nail kit that I got from Avon like years ago. It's a Christmas present. Pamper night. Don't really seem very well, but I'm wearing my jumpsuit. You can't even see it. Hang on. Now you can see me. So it's my pipeline play suit. My Adam's toe in the background. So I put this on. So I said I was going to use it as a fake tanning suit. So this is what I'm using it for. So hopefully it's going to be okay. I'll show you once I've done my nails. Morning. I'm done. And I've got some nails on as well. I'm currently sat in front of my laptop. I try not to be too loud because people are still asleep. Because I've been awake since I went to work at like five. So because I just couldn't sleep because it's light outside. I've been um, editing my blog. I've edited an IGTV. And I'm looking at all my old clothes. And I'm like, I wish I kept all 
but I ain't got no room for them, so I know that was what I had to get rid of them. But it's hard looking back at photos, and I'm like, I wish I kept that item below me. It's really annoying. I'm so happy I got some nails on them, a bit of fake tan to wash off yet. I like it. And I'm all fresh and washed and bare faced. I feel like my skin looks so much better when I fake tan it. Loving my nails, and I've already said that already. I'm gonna go down and do some work. I'm actually wearing a nice dress today because it's sunny outside so I thought get that out that's my charity shop bargain dress for £1.50 all this in Ibiza I link the vlog in the eye I never know what corner it pops up in so I link that up there for you and I'm going to do some work I have got about 100 posts left to edit on my blog and it's doing my friggin head in I just realised right at the beginning of this vlog I was like oh yeah I'm going to make a lemon drizzle cake I said I've done it have I probably do it in the next vlog we'll see what happens i want to make the prep cookies as well so we'll see what i'll do let me start having a lemon and ginger tea i mean it helps my oh god that's strong what my tea mm. i had a memory tea oh yeah lemon and ginger tea and then i can really taste the ginger in it it's only from little so strong but it's really hard for my di digestion and i've noticed yesterday i didn't snack at all we were talking about what i was eating yesterday and i haven't had any snacks apart from <laughs> i had a third of a tube of pringles yesterday <laughs> That's the only snack I had, that was in the morning. Other than that, I didn't really eat much else yesterday. For dinner last night, I had them corn nuggets with rice, sweet corn curry sauce, and I've got that for lunch again today, and I also had some chips. And what we'll have for dinner tonight? We have potatoes and something, probably. This is basically what I had last night. Really nice. Random combination, but I like it. Just been a little walk and stopped into Iceland and picked up some fruit, got some strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, and some watermelon. And I've chucked on some chia seeds and some flax seeds because I really need to start having it because I've got like a massive bag of it. Now. See? Massive bags, like I can't even show you the size difference, but there is my hand. That's how big the bag is. So I've got those. And now on to dinner. I've got a corn chicken covered in curry sauce, broccoli, sweet corn, and potatoes. Just trying to use what we got, to be honest. And we went to Lidl early and bought some more things. Wow, I actually look rather tan sat here. Ooh. Oh, actually, did I even show you what tan I used? I'm sure I did, but I'll show you it again. St. Marie's. Why do I think it was called St. Marie's? But yeah, that's what I used. But anyway, I've just popped on here to say. Thank you for watching and it has come to the end of the vlog and I will start a new vlog tomorrow. It is my brother's birthday tomorrow which is a bit poo because obviously he can't really go anywhere but I wish him happy birthday and send him some presents and things. And other than that I will say goodbye, thank you for watching. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. I'd love to have you back here for more. Thank you for watching so much and to everyone that's new please do subscribe. I'm just repeating myself. So I'm going to go so bye. <laughs>